Troy built 38 inches mower. The deck is too low. It scalps the ground at the third lever position. It should raise higher. Thanks for stopping by, is this a new occurrence? Has it worked properly in the past? With your reply, please include the exact model number of the unit so I can see the same thing as you. Thanks. Bluext Kate 941448.57560000463. I am helping a friend with his mower. It worked okay when it was new. It is only a year and a half old. I took the deck off to sharpen the blades. It is out of adjustment now. There is only three pins holding the deck on. One in the front and two in the rear. It is as Troy built 42 inches. Model hash XXXXX. Thanks for that info. Please take a minute to go through the leveling steps outlined in the owner's manual. Here is a link to the full manual. Click here below, is an image of page 20 that indicates the steps to level after removing it. Page 22 also outlines the steps for the deck removal. Ensure you have followed them all in reverse order so the deck is properly reinstalled. Let me know if you require further. Thanks. Bluext Kate 941448.61481180056. I have read the manual. It does not say how to raise the rear of the deck, which is what I'm trying to find out. The front adjustment nut will raise the front of the deck, a little turn raises it a lot. However, the front of the deck should be a little lower than the rear. When the front of the deck is lower than the rear, it is cutting to short to the ground. Side to side is okay. There is not enough adjustment to get the rear of the mower up. That adjustment is what I want to know. I can read the manual without going online to ask an expert. There should only be one quarter of an inch difference between the front and rear. If the deck hanger brackets are maxed out, to the high limit, and the difference between front and back is one quarter of an inch, then there is a different issue. Without being in front of the tractor, it's not possible to see what went wrong during redocking. And is why I ask that you retrace your steps. Or even start over. To ensure you have followed the correct procedure. Did you lower the height adjustment handle before securing the hanger brackets or raise it? The hanger brackets are what dictate the rear height. What is the status of those brackets? Are they maxed out to high, low, mid? The rear deck hanger brackets on the deck have only two holes per bracket, high and low and both are to low. The rod that connects to the brackets are in a slot at the handle end and no way to adjust them. He'll opt out in hopes another expert can see something that I'm not. Hold tight, when there is a reply. You'll be notified. Bluext Kate 941448.7364990509 my question has not been answered. You either know what I'm talking about or you don't. That is why I went to an expert. Hi there, my name is XXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXX
starting on a level flat guard surface. With the deck on level surface, lift the deck to the ground without putting it in a notch, about what position is that? At what position does the deck touch the ground? Now raise the deck up, at what position does the deck start to raise? Now raising the deck up, what position does the deck stop lifting? Thanks Richard. With the deck on a level flat driveway, there are 5 positions for cut height on the lever. 5 is the highest and 1 is the lowest. At position 3 the bottom of the deck touches the driveway or in other words it will cut to low on the ground. Position 3, 2 and 1 are to low. 4 and 5 will cut but at that height or posy ocean it should be cutting high. Are you familiar with this Troy built model hash XXXXX it is a 42 inches deck? Yes I am. I didn't catch your name either. Before the mowing deck was removed, did the mowing deck set this low? That mower has three adjustments on it I believe. The deck hangers in rear which are two hang ears, one hanger in front and then side to side adjustment no on one side that acts like a gear and raises the deck as well. Thanks Richard. No, before the deck was removed, it was not set that low. I took the deck off to sharpen the blades. Okay maybe the gear for the side to side has to be adjusted for height as well. There are only two holes per hanger in the rear. An upper and a lower. Do you know which one will geo you more height? The upper because it pushes the deck towards the top. The adjusters on the side need adjusting as well. Let me know your findings. If not that, look for something that is bent, because that's all the adjustments that you can do. By the way, the front adjuster when turned clockwise raises the deck. Thanks Richard. Nothing is bent or damaged that I can see. What lever position do you start at to put the deck back on? I know about the front adjuster. So, let me get this straight. The front will adjust higher with the one bar nut turning right or clockwise. The one side adjuster in the rear has a little gear on it to adjust the height as well. The other side to side adjuster in the rear has no adjustment. So how can I raise it if it needs to go higher? I assume that when you took the deck off, that on the front of the deck, the adjusting bar, you remove the cotter pin and not the arm from deck to mower? Is that right? Or did you move the front adjusting bar and deck at the same time? to where the front adjusting bar was still attached to deck when deck wire removed from under mower. I removed the deck last summer to sharpen the blades. This is on my friend's mower. I took three cotter pins out to remove the deck. I don't remember but I think I took the arm off as well. It has been turned now from the original position. Now he is saying that is is cutting to low. It is cutting level. I need to know how to get the deck adjusted again. This will solve your problem. Remove the front adjusting bar, flip it around so the L-shaped adjusting rod is on the other side of the bracket. You have the front adjusting rod turned around backwards. If you don't understand please let me know. 
looking at the front of the deck if the cotter pin is on the right side turn it around so the cotter pin is on the left side. That's it and now the deck is back to normal. If you're satisfied with my answer, please leave a high rating. If you're not satisfied with my answer, please let me know. If you're not satisfied I can opt out and at that point another expert will answer your question if their answer is different from mine. Thanks Richard. Richard 41449.03439944444 Okay, I will stand by for now. This will solve your problem. Remove the front adjusting bar, flip it around so the L-shaped adjusting rod is on the other side of the bracket. You have the front adjusting rod turned around backwards. If you don't understand please let me know. Looking at the front of the deck if the cotter pin is on the right side turn it around so the cotter pin is on the left side. That's it and now the deck is back to normal. If you're satisfied with my answer, please leave a high rating. If you're not satisfied with my answer, please let me know. If you're not satisfied I can opt out and at that point another expert will answer your question if their answer is different from mine. Thanks Richard. Okay thank you Richard. I will accept your answer. I'm not with the tractor right now but I will call my friend and tell him. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.